No apologies, no regrets from former Vice President Dick Cheney for the harsh CIA interrogation techniques used on terror detainees after 9-11. What the Senate Intelligence Committee labeled torture in its blistering report this past week, the former VP today called necessary as he delivered a powerful counterattack this morning on NBC's Meet the Press. Mr. Cheney took strong exception to that Senate report and, contrary to its conclusions, told our Chuck Todd that the interrogation techniques absolutely worked. NBC's Kristen Welker is at the White House tonight with more on this. Kristen, good evening. Lester, good evening. Facing heavy criticism after the Senate intelligence report was released this past week, former Vice President Dick Cheney was unapologetic today and said the Bush administration got it right. Former Vice President Dick Cheney unwavering in his support for the harsh interrogation tactics that happened on his watch today ratcheted up his defense on Meet the Press. I'd do it again in a minute. Cheney argued the methods, including prolonged periods of waterboarding, were necessary in the wake of the September 11th attacks and insisted the procedures were not torture. Torture was what the uh, al-Qaeda terrorists did to 3,000 Americans on 9-11. There is no comparison between that and what we did with respect to enhanced interrogation. A fired up Cheney called the report politically motivated, and that was his more tempered language. I won't use the word on your show. It may be family. It's, it's a crock. It's not true. And he disputed the report's claim that the interrogation tactics provided no credible information. Absolutely All of not. this information in here, no seed of doubt that whether this worked or not. It worked. It absolutely did work. But one of the strongest critics of the program, Republican Senator John McCain, who was tortured as a prisoner of war in Vietnam, took to the Senate floor this week to argue just the opposite. I know from personal experience that the abuse of prisoners will produce more bad than good intelligence. And today, McCain again questioned Cheney's claim that the techniques Bob, worked. Just, it's not about them. It's about us. It's about us. What we were, what we are, and what we, and what we should be. Democrats said what happened was in fact torture. With respect to waterboarding, and uh, the vice president is obviously comfortable with it, uh, I consider it to be torture. Still, there seemed to be little appetite on either side of the aisle for reopening a Justice Department investigation into those responsible for the program. The big question now, what this debate means for the future of the CIA. I think that going forward, uh, you'll see CIA officers very hesitant to use many of these kinds of techniques as long as they remember this investigation. But it's hard to change an institution for many generations. Now, Cheney also disputed the report's claim that President George W. Bush wasn't regularly briefed on the interrogation program. Cheney saying today, quote, that's a flat out lie.